Alright, you're back for another episode of Supermarket Simulator. I don't know why there's a box in here. Let's just find this right away. Let's see. Okay, last time we not only got the storage room, but we expanded it. We also got more crates for... Not crates, shelving for... When we get the next expansions, we've already got the storage that we need. Could I buy the next expansion straight off the bat? Maybe. Maybe able to. Close to three thousand dollars right now. Most likely, they'll definitely got enough for the next project lessons and to buy the products. However, I don't really know where I'm going to keep the stocks, so I think I'm ready to expand the shop first. Let's have a look and see how much that's actually going to cost. Growth protection free. Seven hundred fifty dollars. I can do that right now. Actually, not just do it. Uh, Bills, let's pay these. I'm, do I'm down to just under 2k. Where's the expansion? Back here. I want Could I put the checkouts at the front of the store now then? Instead of having them against that wall? Hmm. Can I move this? I can. Let's move this next door. There we go. I think that makes more sense having that in here with the stock. A lot easier instead of having to run through all the time. I guess I freeze up this space so I can actually put stock layer and I can put the well, I might put a check it there actually. Which one makes sense more sense to put there? Oh, it fits so perfectly on there. Right, okay. The ball lines up pretty much perfectly to that, that's fine. Okay, let's check it. Do I just have it like this? Then they go right at the door. Uh, it's a bit tight getting through here if I'm gonna put stock back here. I mean, eventually I will have this base open as well, to be fair, so I think it will work. It'll just need to be a bit tight for now. Well, I could actually just do this, actually. Uh, is that enough space for me to get in? It's tight, but yeah, there's enough space for me to get in and out. Yeah, I think that works better. But we'll go for this. We'll just open up right now. And we're going to need more stock. Okay, the guys stop filling the shelves means everything. We have back here, it's already fully stocked up, so everything that's got a gap, I need to buy some. This is going to need to be a big order because some of the stuff this double box there only has three or one item in the box. Oh, he's working again. Oh, Cosmo's been. Yep, okay, let's start ordering. Okay, I've got a space for a cereal and two bread, uh, two sugar, two oil, two pasta, and one sugar. That's flour, either, yeah, not sugar. Two pasta. One sugar. There's only enough space for one more box, but it's only three in that box. I'm just gonna buy two, and I'll just need to keep that box somewhere until I can actually put it in the shelf. So I buy two water and two cheese, and then I think this might be full. Oh, it's already is full. Two water, two cheese. In fact, you know what? I'm gonna go grab the stuff, put it on the shelf, and here so this guy can start putting it out on the shelves if they are low, which I think some of the stuff is. And the only issue of me being back here doing this when the store's open, I'm not going to see any messages of them saying if stuff is too expensive or they can't find anything. Oh, what's empty? That is spaghetti. I don't have spaghetti yet. Okay, we're probably going to get some complaints. Why is it lagging? I'm probably going to get some complaints about there being no spaghetti. Why is it lagging again? Why? Okay, where did we get to? We've done the cheese. I think I can get four of these ones. These side. Oh, I might actually be able to get six. Okay, so I'll get two up there. I'll get four coffee and five eggs. After adding the coffee and the only space for two more items, I'm actually going to buy another two of that oil to fill up the space on the shelf to stock it up since there's space for it. Okay, so I was going to add in five of the eggs, one milk, two tea, four peanut butter. I could only get two of the peanut butter in. Oh, it's after 9 pm. Okay, I didn't even, I, that didn't even cross my mind. I'm going to do this in one. Oh, they tell they are, um, how do I open this again? Okay, next in here, please. Wow, they are all coming to, I need to get a light over here, it's dark. Just some milk for you, no problem. Not a big order for you, that's fine. Some cash, no change needed, perfect. Oh, that's a big order. It's not actually that many more items, but more expensive items. $52 and change. Just two coffee for you. 
I'm glad to see we're still in coffee still. I feel like it doesn't sell as much and they want to sell that yet. Okay, yes, I'm out of a lot of stuff. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have opened. $28. Oh, it's $28.50. I almost forgot about that. 50 Okay, that is us. I can get off of this. Let's close this. My shelves are empty yet. I didn't get to actually stocking any of this stuff. I think all oh, this stuff has been ordered or it's in the basket. But none of this stuff has been ordered yet. Yeah, okay. Well, I think that's that for this day. That's in in this day off. Eleven products not found yet. Yeah, okay, I expected that to be high. I already messed up. Products found expensive six. I wonder what they were for. I kind of wish it told me on the screen. Okay, I can order this straight off the bat. Is it peanut butter? I want to add another two peanut butter into this one. I'm actually going to put some of the stuff on the shelves to make sure you can stock up. Then when you get the supreme flower, uh, oh what box size are they? I think the other bigger boxes are I can fit two of them in. Olive oil, I'll be able to fit six of them in actually because they're the smaller ones. Do I need six boxes? No. How many did I fit in? Oh perfect, okay let's purchase that. I think the oil, no the oil wasn't that empty but it was low so I'll put this stuff in. I wish I could carry more than one box. There's a box pack here, I didn't not see this. This is the previous shop as well. I'm glad I found it. Oh, you've put the water. Why did you put that? Oh. Is this space one bottle? Please tell me this. There's not. Okay, well, I'm going to put this here. Okay, let's get rid of that. Uh, what's after oil oil? This is spaghetti. Okay, so I think only two of them will fit in the rack, but the shelf is completely empty, so I'm going to order four. Rice, I will order five boxes. I don't know how many of the boxes so I will fit in that, but I'm not bu buying like. I think it's nine, and then nine. I'm not buying 18 of them. That would take too far too long for me to bring through. How much rice do I want? Five. I buy five for the rice. I can actually fit one into this order. Let's purchase that. Uh, let's add in another four. I'm pretty sure that will last me a while. Orange juice to actually I'll just get two of everything else. But I should actually just stock the shelves before putting them in for the back because a lot of this stuff is empty. I say that if, as I was doing the race we only needed one thing. Cut the pick something I already had stock off so. Apple juice I can go in the shelf. Actually I think that's full. No it's not. It's a full roll. Ten for the cola. It's this one here. Pasta bread. Flour. Actually, this was only nine in this as well, so I think you'll get another one of these flowers. Pasta and a bread. This is going to put that light in before I forget. I mean, we only have five items now. Do I buy that second fridge? Do I buy a second one of these or do I just buy one of these? I oh, know, I'll buy one of these and now and I'll just have this stuff going across the two fridges and then if I need a fridge for the next license then I'll buy one of these instead of going for this. It stacks so neatly. That, that is one strong light, that's for sure, jeez. Well, there's actually not that many lights in here. I may actually need a few. I just realised all the lights over there. There was text there and I didn't pay attention to it. I'll put that there over the checkout at least. Again, I lost a lot of cereal. I'm going to get out of cereal. Oh, it's really getting dark and you go put the little $99. It's the most expensive order yet. Head away, please. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Can I put this? I can put it in. Good, I can get rid of this box now. Okay, not completely sure where I'm going to actually put this fridge because it fits so perfectly. I never closed my checkout, just realised. No, it's busy. It's fine. Yeah, I guess I could actually just move this. Oh no, I can't move it over. Right. Um, I'm not going to fit the f uh, second fridge in there. I don't think. I'll try and move this over, but I don't think there's enough space. Yeah, but okay, now I can fill both of the fridges with this juice. You can never at the point do that or 
Do I get a new life project license right now? Do I get it? When your shelves are completely empty, you're like, well, I, I keep doing that. Let's go and help out and fill these shelves up in the morning so I can see how I'm looking for in terms of stock. I'm going to be low again, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Okay, I'm working, still working away getting putting stuff back, but most of it is fully stocked. It's just a couple of things like the low. I'm going to end off the day. Okay, one product I've found that is much better. Two products found expensive, no clue what they were. I didn't make a profit today, I did spend quite a lot in stock. Yeah, you know what, I think I'm just going to open up straight away because everything's pretty much full anyway. And yeah, he's not got anything to put back. Let's have a quick look and see what I need to order more of. Actually, I need to order more than I thought. Okay, I think I'm sorted after this. Let's just fill this shelf up straight away. Okay, it's the end of the day once again. I must again the shelves. I'll look at a little here. Some a lot of stuff I still have loads of stock off never mind. I have either at least one box almost everything. Just a few things have run out very recently. Can I hire a second person to do the shelves? Because I feel like he's not really keeping up anymore. Oh, my bills, I almost forgot. And he will level 22, not high enough yet. Next license is 550. I can actually unlock quite a lot of them now. I, I do want to get the next license. Maybe I'll just do that the next day regardless. Maybe I'll order all this stuff and put them fill the shelves before the store opens. And then also actually get the next license. So I'm actually making some progress today. I think I'll do that. First off, I need to end off this day. Five products not found, five things found expensive. Yeah, he's not really keeping up anymore. I did make a profit of 945, even though I did spend quite a lot. Cheese, salt, pasta. It's one cereal, two bread, two it's flour. All your goods, two pasta, two water, no cheese, one eggs. One milk, one tea, one peanut butter, two flour, and one of these colours. Uh, seven items, you know what? I'm going to actually order three lights. I should go to light up the shop a bit more. That's that basket full, purchase. Okay, I've put everything into the shelves. There's a few gaps of brewing already. But you know what? I'm going to buy the next license right now. I don't actually know what is actually in the license. That's the wrong menu. Let's see, up is what? I've had any shelves or fridges, but let's find out. So, the new items we have are cake, cake, candy, cereal, chocolate bar, and yogurts. Are the cakes new items? I don't remember them being in one of a series that I watched. It was the same with the spaghetti and the rice. But okay, I'm going to order two of everything for the new items, and then at the end, I want to know the size of the boxes and how many actually. And if I use a full box, a single shelf. I can then order more for the actual stock room if needed. Next, order the two yogurts. Is there anything that I'm really low on? Okay, I've added a few items that were running low. There's two boxes of the pasta on the shelf. However, there's actually only seven boxes of pasta actually on the shelf. So, in the boxes. That's annoying if not just combined it into the two boxes or use the box that are slow instead of using the full box first. So shelf, 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 fridge. Okay, the yogurt's in the fridge and that's the only thing. The only thing is I don't have any space in the fridge. Oh wait, no I do. I've got space below the cheese, don't I? I do, I find any space perfect. Where is the yogurt? Give me a box here, thank you. You can just go in here. Okay, a full box is... Okay, that's perfect. I'll throw this over there then now. Other yogurt. Next up is for the shells. I have one shell spare. Okay, I'm going to need another unit. I think it's going to work out perfectly because I think it's five items I've got here. If I put this on the shelf below the salt, it doesn't really go with the stuff on that shelf, but it's next to the cereal. Then I can have the another shelf. And I have it for the two cakes, the candy, and the chocolate. I think this shelf is probably going to be. Oh, yeah, I could actually just put it here actually. I could put it there. Yeah, we'll put it there for now and then we'll keep this going up the next stuff, the next lot. Do what we got for our cereal. And our full box goes there, perfect. This one, oh, it's all the cereal, okay. Chocolate. 
Okay, we've got two K. We've we'll got the chocolate in this one. It's a full shelf for a box of the full shelf. Okay, and we we'll put the candy below it. I'll we'll put the two cakes above it. I don't know why I've decided to do it like that. Like, there's no reason for the cakes to be in the top two. As long as they're together. Okay, before I open up this set, these prices before I forget. First off, the cereal. This can go six dollars. Then the yogurts, they can be. Let's make them two. Don't make a profit off two. I just don't make a profit. Okay, that's fine. Stuff in the bottom. Candy, that can be $4.50. Uh, chocolate can be. We'll just make that four. These cakes can be four fifty as well. And this cake can be two fifty. Prices are set. Let's open up. Start making money. This is close. Let's tidy up this mess I've left out here. He hasn't worked anymore, good, okay, so everything is fully stocked. I'll go through, see if there's any more gaps in the storage. With the cereal, I'll only be able to fit two on the stock shelves. Everything else... What size of box was the cake? I've already bought No, I'll just buy two of each of these again. Um, oh, this, I need to move that cereal. This cereal needs to be moved. This can be the extra stock section. Let's get rid of these labels. Oh wait, should it be this way or should it go from here to that way? It should probably go from this way, shouldn't it? So it's going left to right. It's always going left to right on these sh shelves. From here to here and here to here. Yeah, I think that makes more sense. Okay, it's time to end of the day. The shelves are looking very empty. Some of the stuff I actually sold out of. I never tried to see what I was running low of. I suppose not found one that was right at the end of the day, I did see him walking out. I didn't know what it was because I didn't just catch the end of it, I just I saw I couldn't find. I'm afraid it might have been from the orange juice because there was none of that on the shelf. Five products been expensive. I did lose a lot of money that day. And between supplies and upgrade costs, I spent a lot of money. Okay, some of the stuff is very empty, but I'm going to get a lot of orange juice, that's for sure. Let's have a look in the stock room, see what's completely empty. The water is the water is too expensive apparently. It's not really though, is it? You no, know I'll just put it into three pound now. I'll lose a, I'll, I will I would say I'm losing money but I'm not, I'm still making one dollar nine on it. I like how that even though they get to the check it first, they still go by the in the order of who's been waiting the longest. That would never happen in real life. I should say the new products are selling well. They do seem to be popular. Oh, very popular apparently. Okay, what is low? What are they filling up? I would just, okay, I'm gonna get that cola. I'm gonna beat them to it. It's 9 pm now. Damn it, it was 7 pm when I started this order. Then I'll just add one coffee to it and make that up to 10. Oh, we had to budget it till the next day. That's it, ready for the next day. I'm just gonna increase the menu order in a single. I should you increase the amount that you can do it in a delivery. Because 10 isn't much these days. A lot of chocolate. Some yogurt and cheese. And eh, not cheese, that's cake. Buying a lot of the newer stuff. Alright, I think I'm just going to end off the day here. I think there's only a couple of things I still need topped up. So I'm just going to end it here. Let's see. Okay, no products not found. Perfect. Five items are expensive still. I didn't make a profit today, good. Okay, the candy is going down. Okay, that's going to be the end of this day as well, so let's end it off. 40 satisfied customers, free items, very expensive. We're in the profit again, even though we spent a lot of supplies. Orange juice, soda, oil. Uh, actually, we might be able to put this back up to 350 now. You know what? This will be the last day. We're going to open up straight away. I've got an order already ready to be purchased. Put this in and we'll actually order the new stuff. Get another license. Since I've got over 4k. Hopefully. And I'll just set the prices as I put it onto the shelf so I don't actually lose all my money on the items. Okay, that stuff is put away. That's order. Well, first off, I need to buy the next license. Oh, 750. I'm probably going to get complaints now because I don't have them on sale right now. 
Okay, so it's now the cleaning products section. Okay, so we've got bleach, cleaner, dishwasher tablets, hand soap, shampoo and toilet paper. Right, I'm going to need two shares for other stuff. Let's buy two of each. And you know, I'll order four of the toilet paper. On the furniture and we'll buy two of these shelves. Did I not buy the shelves? Did I not quite buy? I, I didn't purchase, okay. Well, we're going to, need to put that over in this corner. Hey, that may be quite tight. I'm going to need to expand the shop again soon. Ah, it's not going to fit in that corner. Uh, it's a bit cramped, it's a bit ugly, but it works. Our stuff. Bleach up the top. So the kids can't reach it. Oh, set price, set price, set price. Before somebody picks it up. We'll go $5. Check it's a full, okay, well, they're just going to wait because I'm busy putting stuff on the shelves. Let's throw it over here then now so I can set the price. And we'll just go $6, that's fine. Toilet roll, we'll put two of the toilet roll over here, we'll just do it on the bottom two. Oh, the toilet paper is very expensive, we'll go $16. That's going to just go $3. That's why he's going to pick that up there before I set the price. Yep, we've got the price. I hope they didn't pick anything up from here. 21. Give me a box again. I can just use this for this side. Right, just actually just put this full shelf as the toilet paper for now. Because you can actually only get two in each section, so you can only get four in a row. I don't have space for this anymore. There's one box for both sides. I was thinking there was five in there. Right, okay, but I'm going to put this down. Let's put the lights on. I was thinking there's five in the shelf, but there's four. Okay, well, I'm just going to put this up here. Then, once they two disappear, I will expand it over to the other side. And there's a lot of customers standing about for check it. I'm going to jump on. Okay, the check it's open. Sorry for your wait. There's a lot of people coming over here. I don't buy many items. It's boring me a little bit. They're all buying only a couple of items. That's better. Oh, the toilet was expensive as well. Oh, it's just emptying the shelves, jeez. That's top it does a person need. $104. I think that's the most expensive shop yet. Well, that I've seen anyway. Can I buy like, a couple of the new items? And I buy all the sort of jeez. Could be another expensive one. $88. That's not actually as, as expensive as I thought it was going to be. Another person buy a toilet roll. Oh, more toilet roll, jeez. $118. Can buy a set for the customers. Yeah, the shelves are going to be very, very empty. The toilet roll's not going to last very long on the shelves at all. I can put this out in the next shelf next to it now. Okay, all of these shelves are very... Eh, they're not all that not that bad, but some of the stuff is very empty. But seven products not found. I didn't realise we were struggling that much in terms of stock, but I know a few of them were definitely from when I got the new licence because I hadn't put them on the shelf yet. I see one or two people for that. Four products very expensive. We didn't make any money today, but we did spend a lot on upgrades and supplies. So again, we'll end this video off here. We bought two new licenses and we got an expansion for the store. Changed the layout a bit. And this is looking a lot better. We will buy the next expansion in terms of growth and then start using the open floor here for shelves. I can put stuff back to back. That's going to be the first video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you tomorrow for another video. See ya.